farming of the future. That's what one man calls what's happening at the old juvenile detention center in Newcastle. Our first news on Fox reporter Desiree Goslin just took a tour of their urban farm recently. She's live now in the newsroom explaining this education program. Desiree. Lawrence County Social Services took over the old juvenile detention center a few years ago and ever since they have been renovating it and one of their initiatives is to teach children about healthy food. They and they're doing that by teaching them how to grow it and they have a traditional outdoor garden and this food lab where they grow lettuce for meals for children in their early childhood education program. This room can produce enough lettuce to feed 425 students. I'm told it can take several hours to harvest this room when it's fully grown, somewhere around 40 to 50 pounds of lettuce. A lot of our kids think food comes from the Dollar General or the supermarket. They don't understand you know, how the process of food works. So to teach them agriculture, to teach them things that they can do at home to make healthy decisions with their eating, uh, that will influence so much in their lives. Good nutrition is, of course, essential, especially in young children. Healthy eating is linked to increased brain function and development. The produce doesn't just go to feed children, though. It's also donated to the community through a meals box program to help the elderly and the poor. And I also got to speak to a farming specialist while I was there, and he told me some more about this really interesting technology that they're utilizing there. I'm going to be sharing more about that coming up in the next half hour. Reporting in the newsroom, Desiree Goslin, WKBN 27 First News.